All right, guys, welcome back to Val Elzia 2 with your pal Super Turtle. Guys, hope you're having a fantastic day. We're going to get right into it today, guys. So in the last episode, we went ahead and we made a solar panel. Now, I've also done a bunch of work over here. I've added this cool bridge, added some strawberries over here. Check this bridge out. It looks pretty neato. Looks pretty neato. We got these fishes here. It's starting, I think it's wintertime, obviously, because it's starting to really freeze over. Uh, but I also added in this cool upgraded fence thing. You're an idiot. And, yeah. So, check this out. I have also uh, added four uh, four more <laughs> four more solar panels. And, uh, yeah, it's been running really good. I ended up actually changing our uh, ore doubling process. Because these pipes seem to have issues pulling out from the side. So, I made it a way that... It always pulls out from the bottom because it would just get stuck in here with the thing on the side. So the only way to fix that was to just have it come through the bottom. And then there's one that comes through the bottom here, loops around, and comes up here, as you can see. So anyway, that's how this is working. We have got a heck ton of upgrades. Check this out. I went ahead. We have the 3x3 three three diamond chest like I had talked about. I love it. Uh, we have the furnators on the sides of here. I have these this one wired up. Uh, with the mechanism pipes under here, and obviously, as you can see, mechanism pipes over here. So we're all using this power here. So the, what we're going to go ahead and do right now is upgrade these power. So to do that, we need to get some of these guys. Now, the cool thing is we got some gold. We got some red stone. What else do we need? We need those things. These things. Is that all the things that we have? Yeah, it looks like it. Badink, badink. Yes, that is working beautifully. Let's go ahead and make up these two little battery cell things. Bam, shabam. Okay, so we got those. We need osmium and three of these infused alloys. That's not a difficult task. Um, place that here. These here. This here. This here. And these in the corners. And shabang. Upgrades, baby. Upgrades. So now we have a 3.2 million FE that we can store. So that's great. Uh, but I also want to go ahead and upgrade the solar panels that we got. But if we hit uses here, we can make the advanced solar generator. Now we just need four of these, two of these infused alloys, and three of the iron ingots. So let's go ahead and grab some iron. And we will grab this guy. Okay. There we go. So let's go ahead and steal some solar panels. All right. So one, two, three, four. Okay. So we're going to be hurting on power for a bit. We're going to be using more power than we can produce. It's okay because we're going to upgrade. Okay. And you here. You here. You here. You here. Bing, bang, wang. All right. So we got some advanced, uh, an advanced solar panel, baby. Better power, more power, baby. More power, baby. All right. So anyway, so let's come over here to this guy because I think it's a lot bigger. Yeah. Yes. That is looking very nice. Now this produces 80 per tick. Or no, it says it's producing 109 right now. This produces 18. This is a much bigger power upgrade than I was actually anticipating. That is amazing. We need to make three more so we can get two of these guys running. So solar panels, what do we need? We need one of these. Cool. We need a lot more of those, actually. So for it's just one... So we need two more. Very good. Very good. For this guy, we don't need any good. Now, for this guy, all we're missing is the solar panels, which requires that. And glass panes. What a pain. <coughs> I'm, I'm sorry. Okay. To make you... We need more osmium. Okay, so we can make two more of these. What else do we need? We need some more of those panels. Which require these guys. Okay, so we're going to need to put some more in here. 
Actually, just get that one going. Yes. Yes. Okay, there we go. Oh. There we go. Okay, now all we need for this is two of those and one more panel. Yep. Let's go grab that other panel. Okay. Advanced solar panels are quiet. I dig it. All right, here we go. Our second advanced solar panel generator. Sorry. Bam, check that out. Living like Larry now, boys and girls. All right. Yeah, so we're going to need to redo our power setup here, which is fine. Oh, we need that. Okay. We'll come in and fill that up later. All right, so these are going to be good for a while. These deliver 1. Point, was it 1. Point, yeah, 1.28 kfe. Place that there. All right. Actually, Oh, that's not it. Oh, whoops. All right, so these are generating power during the day. So let's go ahead and take a nap. Yep, I hear him generating power. Good. Let's go have a looky looky over here. -y. All right. Oh. Oh, okay. So we have to have power come out of this guy. All right, all right, all right, all right. So can I put him here? I can, okay. We need to position it correctly. So like this maybe, yes, okay. And then we'll take one of these guys and we'll poke it up like this. Look at all that power flowing. Okay, and so, can we put this guy here? We sure can. Power there. Huh. All right. 
So we are generating, so this one is generating 109 FE per tick. This one's generating 109 FE per tick. So what that means is that we are generating 218 FE per tick, which is amazing. Great, great upgrade. Yes, yes, great upgrade. Let's see here, how are you doing? Oh yeah, look at that go up. Are these still producing power too? They are. Yeah, baby. This is going up real good. That's interesting. Blue. All right, so it's saying input is 218. Yep, that's what we're doing. Out, input, tool. We're going to keep it as FE. Interesting. Okay. All right. So we got this upgraded. Very good. That means we have more power in our system, but we're only getting power at night. Oh, well. Okay. I meant uh, daytime, by the way, with this thing. We get only get power during the daytime, but we do get a heck ton of it. So this should last us through the night. But I want to go ahead and work on an enrichment chamber. This is very cheap to make. Uh, I should have some osmium left. Yes, I do. So let's go ahead and add a few in here. We'll say 16 of those. I think we're out of osmium after that. That is okay. Um, we don't need osmium after this for a bit. We can go mining for it. It's annoying to get. Actually, actually, actually. Yes, more osmium. Haha. -ha. We do have more. Oh, oh, look at all this osmium. Beautiful. It is amazing. Let us get some coal in here. Bam. Okay, so we only need two of these, so we're good with this. We do need some steel, though, which we get by not doing that. We need, we need to use some coal and the crusher. Okay, so we should have everything we need for the chassis now. So let's go ahead here. Oh, we need an osmium. That's fine. Bam, a lamb. Two iron ingots. All right, investor chamber. Cool beans. So this is one step closer to Mopal, baby. Anyway. So we put some, can we put redstone in here for enrichment? We can. What does this do in the enrichment chamber? This becomes the enriched redstone, which will offer more yield for our machines here. Very cool. We can do that with our diamonds too for when we need to go to that tier. Because uh, I was looking at the atomic disassembler, which I've heard is an amazing tool for mechanism. But it requires refined obsidian ingots, which is okay. But we're going to need an osmium compressor here with like liquid osmium. Um, yeah, so this is, wait, is there a way to do this? Uh, no, so the only way to do this is an osmium compressor with liquid osmium. With osmium, yeah. So, and then to get this, we need the advanced ones, which we could actually probably make, but we're not gonna make right now because we just made the enrichment chamber, which Allows us to do this with the osmium. Do we have any more left? Yes, we do. Okay, you're out of there. You're out of there. Bam. Check this out. Yeah. Very cool. Very, very cool. Actually, let's give this a go. Uh, what was it? Osmium compressor? This guy? Yeah. So steel casing. So we're going to need some more steel. It's a one-to-one -one ratio. So we need a total of four more in here. I thought it was a one to two, but it's a one to one. Very cool. So let's see, just to make that, we just need two of these. Do I have any more of those? I do. All right, we're gonna need two buckets. Whoops. Whoops. What is going on here? 
All right, that's almost done. We got two steel. Good. Good. Look at that. That's This is all full, and these machines were running. Cool beans. Now, what do we do with the osmium dust? We can just smelt it up. Perfect. All right, there we go. We got all of our stuff. All right, so osmium compressor. We need one of these bad boys. And kapow. Osmium compressor. Yes. But it looks like we will need fluids, right? Energy. I don't know. Maybe. Put osmium here. <gasps> oh, it works. That's all. That's all you need. Amazing. Okay. So we need to go collect some obsidian. And I've added vein miner into the pack just for like the speed, the speed help speed things up. So don't frown on me too much. It is what I needed. Okay. Do not question my genius. It is mine, my, my genius, and my genius alone. Okay, so what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're gonna grab some water. We're gonna eat this thing. Look, I, I've cleared a bunch of trees over here. I do. I would like to put some cool base over there pretty soon. I've got some ideas. I've got some ideas, peeps. Deers. I like deers. That's weird. Okay, so very simple. Um, where do we want this? Hmm. Hmm. This seems fine. Now we're going to place this here. Like I said, we're going to walk over here. We're going to vein mine this. We're going to be here for a minute. Seventeen, yeah, baby. All right, so we got forty-one obsidian, just like that, dudes and dudettes. Pretty neat, huh? Yeah, I would say so. Okay, so it looks like we need to throw some diamonds in the enrichment chamber. We are running low on diamonds. Uh, we're gonna go five in the enrichment chamber, like so. We're gonna need to convert this into the diamond one for now, but it wouldn't be a bad idea to actually upgrade this while we can. So if we go uses here, we should be able to upgrade it to the basic one. Yes. And all we need is some more iron to do so. So I say we try to upgrade this twice. Okay, so top, bottom, uh, and then here, and then here, and then like this, is that right? No, it's not right. Oh, it's, it's not even these, it's redstone. Yes. Okay. And then to upgrade this guy, yes, we need those. We need two of these. Whoa. What just happened? Okay. I might have pressed E on accident. Okay. And then to upgrade this. Okay. So we need osmium, two osmium. Get those smelting up. That's quick. Yeah, that's quick. Okay. So the second osmium just showed up. Cool beans. So here, 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 and here. All right, that's the size we're going to go right now. Yes. So we're good. So we're going to go ahead and take the enriched diamonds that we have, put them here. Oof, that was not a lot at all. Okay. Now, can we throw the obsidian in here? Will that work? No. Oop, hello, phone. Okay, uses. What do we want to do? What do we want to do? What do we want to do? Enrichment chamber is how we get the dust. Okay, perfect. So we'll put 16 in here. So now I can make the nether portal that I've always wanted to make. So we can go to the nether and get some quartz. I think it'd be fun to go explore the nether a little bit today. Okay, so we have the obsidian dust. Let's go ahead and throw it in here. No? Okay, well, how do we make the... Oh, we need the diamond one. That's right. That's why we did this. Okay. 
Now, it looks like we're actually going to be able to pull this off today. I did not think we'd be able to do that. We're going to go ahead and do that. Okay, so these are all done. Uh, let's go ahead. I believe it's this one. Yeah, we just need one of these. Atomic alloy. Right, so... Enriched obsidian, put these in the enrichment chamber. Okay, we made one of these. Let's go ahead and make as many of these as we can. Let's go ahead and make some more of these guys. Oops, not, not copper. We need 16 more of these guys getting made up. Enrichment chamber's doing its thing. Osmium compressor. Damn, that's pretty cool. Okay, refined obsidian ingot. Very cool. So we got the one we needed. We're actually not going to use that one. Okay, so these should be all good. Uh, 290. I don't want to... We dumped it. Oh, we dumped it. Ah, whatever. <sighs> all right, you're in there. You're in there. Now, how are we going to charge this thing? Uh, I haven't thought that far ahead. We're going to make a charger. Okay, so we made one of these. We have everything we need. And Cowabunga Boys Atomic Disassembler. We have done it. Look at this baby. It's so beautiful. It's That's not the right one. Look at it. Hey, get out of my inventory. I want to look at you. Yes, we're going to screenshot that. Beautiful. Atomic disassembler. Okay, so charger maybe. Um that's from Powa. Maybe we can try this. And we should have everything we need for these still. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we got that too. We'll grab some more of these. Okay, so what else do we need? Just this guy, which just requires some more iron. Okay, that's Gucci. All right, here we go. And Cowbunga, energy charger. So let's get this guy here. Does this get in power? It is not. Okay, so the front needs to be output. Nope, still not getting power. We put it here like this. Oh, we need to configure the sides. Dang, stupid idiot myself. Okay, so bottom. Extract, maybe? Got all this FE. All the sides are programmed for output. It's not working. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. So this charger, unfortunately, won't work. Can you put that in there? Okay. At mechanism, maybe? Found it. This has our own thing to do it. Very cool. So now we're charging up this bad boy. Let's go to sleep so we can start generating more power for our system. All right. Our atomic disassembler is fully charged, everyone. Let's go test it out on some cool stuff. All right, so energy mode normal efficiency twenty. So let's let's go let's go have a wee look down here, shall we? We're gonna be going there pretty soon. Okay. All right, we're down here at the mine. Let's see. 
Well, this is the speed it mines in. Okay, now is there a button for this? Atomic disassembler uses. Hmm. Hmm. Free runners. One on feet. Interesting. Isn't there a jetpack through this guy, too? Yes, right here. Jetpack. What do we need? Steel basic control unit. Ba <gasps> jetpack, baby! Let's go get a jetpack! Alrighty. So, we need some steel right away. So, we're going to start working on that. We do have kind of a buildup of steel over here. We can throw those in, too. Very good. Okay, so jetpack. Armored jetpack, too. Ooh, yeah. Armored jetpack. That's what we need in our life. Okay. Wait. Nope. We need a crusher. We need a crusher for that. Uh, crusher, 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 crusher. You. Okay, let's make this. I'll make this off camera. Yeah. Okay, here we go. We have the jetpack crafted up. A very cool. Uh, so now we can go ahead and get the crusher crafted up. We just need one more of these guys, actually. Uh, let's go ahead and throw him in there. Nope, it was you, Osmium. That's right. Okay. So let's see about getting this jetpack charged up for us right now. Oh. Oh, what? No gas stored. So how do we store gas in it? Hmm. I thought this just ran on power. I'm sad. <laughs> okay, so we have the jetpack. I don't know if we're going to be able to really do anything with said jetpack, uh, which is quite quite unfortunate. Um, but I will expand this pipe over like so. Crusher goes here. Eventually, this crusher will replace this guy. Uh, but we need to upgrade it a few times. So we're going to put this here, two of these. Uh, yep, we need one more of the iron ingots to come up because we need to make a block of steel. These will get crushed. Uh, we need to work on the upgrades for this guy so that it's very energy efficient, which is what I want. And same as this guy too. We, I mean, we could do that now, make it very energy efficient, but I need to get that uh, higher tier. Okay, cool. So block of steel should be, yep, ready and armored jetpack requires one of these. And two copper, was that right? Or is it bronze that we need? Let's see here. It's bronze, fun, fun time. So we need 10 and three copper. Okay, so we got some bronze, armored jetpack. Here we go. Okay, so we have the armored jetpack here. Uh, let's see here, if we go like this, does it put it on? It does. Yeah, baby. Look at our stuff. We're getting all mechanismed up. But anyways, guys, that's going to wrap up the episode for today. I'm going to do some research off camera of how to get some power and our gas into the jetpack. So I will see you all after that. But anyways, guys, hope you all have a fantastic day. I will see you in the next one. Take care. Peace out. I love your face. Bye. <laughs> Okay, so did some research, and we should be able to make this uh, uh, in the electrolytic, well, electrolytic separator. You guys need to make this. Very simple to make. Actually, kind of simple to make. It's just uh, some iron redstone, some infused alloy, one of these electrolytic cores, which is just gold dust, iron dust, osmium dust, and then the infused alloys. So this is how we did it. I've already wired power over to here. Uh, so if we put this in here like so, it should start to make some hydrogen. And now if we pull this out... And put it in here. Yes, we're storing hydrogen in here. Perfect. Now, what we can do is make a sink. Yes, this fool right here. Now, let's see if we can still make this guy. Is this thing still cheaty as heck like it was? Let's get some clay. 
Actually, let's just get all the clay. So we're going to need a total of five of these. One, two, three, four, five. We will throw it here. Get out of there, coal dust. We're just going to leave coal dust in here because that's pretty much our primary use for that thing. Okay, we'll let this smelt up. Okay, so we got our five there. Let's go ahead and get our three iron ingots there. Let's go ahead and grab some water. I thought I grabbed water. Oh, I, I threw it into the, the thing already. Okay. There we go. Okay, so let's craft up this sink here. All right. And now we need the fluid pipes from Mechanism. Mechanical pipe. These guys. Okay, so it's just a bucket and two steel. That's not difficult at all. Two steel, bucket, uh, yes. Okay, so if we place this guy here. Does water come out of that? Um, hmm. Okay, so maybe this won't work like that just yet. We'll have to try something else. Uh, but let's go ahead, break this though. This will allow us to just have water right here whenever we need. So let's grab just three more iron. We made so many buckets in this episode, it's crazy. Yep, then we're putting the stored hydrogen. Okay, so... These energy upgrades are very important. We will work on these later, but it requires two glass, two infused alloy, and you have a total of eight of these you can put in each machine. So we're going to make a heck ton of these. I want to get two stacks of gold for this. So we're going to need a total of four stacks of the infused alloy, which means we need a lot of stuff. Um, so we can do that later. Uh, but let's see about filling this bad boy all the way up. I will fill this up off camera or find a way to get this to work properly. <laughs> Um, it might involve an extra tank or something like that. Oh, we also have RF tools power. Cool, so we can use these guys, dimensional cells. Very cool. These transfer a heck ton of power early on, so we can get into those soon. It'll be awesome. Yeah, look at that. Dimensional cell. Okay, so let's test this out. Put this bad boy on. All right. Go over here. Come out here. Woohoo! Whoa, 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 wow. Yes, we can take fall damage from this. So let's see here, Two, 29, 18, let's go up. Oh, you can see in the bottom left. You see it over there with the, the silver or the gray buttons? Yeah. So now we have we have a jetpack power, baby. <gasps> jetpack power, baby. But that's going to wrap up the episode for today, guys. If you did enjoy, please make sure to hit that like button. And as always, don't forget to subscribe, guys. But I will see you in the next episode. Peace out. I love your face. I hope you did well in your, your finals. Cause some people had their test. But anyway, I'll see you later. Peace out. Bye-bye. All right. I said I would go to the nether in this episode, so let's go ahead and do that now. All right. So we have our cool handy-dandy atomic disassembler, our jetpack, and I even made some free runners to help us with fall damage. So now we no longer take any fall damage. So let's go on and hop through to the nether. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs>